Hello and welcome to My Security TV. My name is Chris Cubbage and we're at the Australasian Oil and Gas Exhibition at the Perth Convention Centre. I'm joined by Mr David Hofkesang, the Managing Director of Direct Communications. David, thanks for joining us. David, we were talking about your communication technologies uh, and specifically you're targeting uh, the oil and gas and mining sector. Analog, digital, satellite, can you talk us through your product range? Yes, uh, broad range and with the technology changing these days from the uh, original analog format through the digital formats, there's a huge change going on from analog, Tetra, P25, DMR, and new forms of digital communication are coming through. There's many, many options these days. And with those options, are you seeing clear trends in relation to these, this technology, or is it application specific? Uh, we've got different um, forms of technology, we've got uh, different digital platforms that we use, and each one is specific to the, to the target need of the, uh, the client. And open communications versus closed and secure, what's the most secure form of communication? Uh, there's, there's digital radio communications these days that have got full AES and DES encryption techniques that you can't, you can't monitor, they're secure all the way through. Um, and, and that would be for the uh, specific needs of the clients, how they want to operate their business and what that means to them as to what levels of encryption and what levels of security, whether it's just purely analog with some basic form of, of security or all the way down to the real McCoy. Right. Uh, you've got a few uh, samples here. Just talk us through. This is uh, an analog radio? It's an analog radio for your general runner general communications needs of, of clients that aren't overly worried about security yes. or, or eavesdropping on people. Then you've got uh, digital formats like this one, which is a, uh, a P25 APCO style radio, uh, and that provides uh, a greater form of security and coverage. And then you've got things like Tetra radios, which go the next level again, and you've got further advances with DMR, which provide uh, uh, GPS operations, they've got RFID, they've got uh, identification and messaging on them, all the way through right. different levels, specifically to the customer's needs. You service Western Australia. Yes. Uh, well done on, on this type of business because, it, again, it's one of those niche uh, specialised industries uh, and, and good luck for the, for the exhibition. Thank you. Good on you, thanks.